Hi SV friends, glad to see you all in this month of December. This month I'd like to share a few thoughts on Jesus Christ being our Good Shepherd. In Luke chapter 2 we can find that angel went to the shepherds to share the good news. Uh, so shepherds were chosen to whom the good news was shared when Jesus Christ was born. Wise men had to come uh, in search of Jesus Christ. They had start, but then it took them very long time to uh, search uh, where Jesus was and to come and uh, offer worship to him. But uh, Jesus Christ, uh, when Jesus Christ was born, angel angels themselves went to the shepherds and shared the good news. There is a significance as to why shepherds were chosen to whom the news were shared at uh, on that day. Uh, so shepherds are uh, uh, lowest of the strata. They, uh, they were outside the town of Bethlehem and they were in the cold winter uh, uh, tending to the sheep, left all the comfort of the house uh, and uh, they were there uh, protecting the flock from enemies. Jesus Christ also, he left all the riches and he came to this world he, uh, to give us salvation. The, it's, uh, we can see in Philippians chapter 2 that uh, through his poverty we may become rich. So this is one aspect. And one more thing is shepherds know how to tend to the flock how to take care of them. So when uh, sheep cannot walk, like when it is a lamb and uh, it is very weak, shepherd takes it and uh, carries it on his uh, shoulders. When sheep are, are uh, injured or uh, they are not well, shepherd acts as their physician and takes care of them uh, tends to their injur injuries, binds them and uh, ensures that they become well again. And he feeds the flocks. So this is what Jesus Christ also is to us. He is our good shepherd. He is our physician. He is our provider. He is our everything. Then he left everything, uh, the entire uh, heavens and came to this world in the form of human he is God. He became God with us so that through his poverty, we may become rich. So if God has done so much for us and he is our good shepherd, does it not entitle us? Does it not make us to become like that to others? So when somebody is in need or somebody requires our attention, somebody requires our prayers, may we also be like that. See, Jesus Christ, uh, I read it. I read this in uh, one of the sites. He intends, Jesus Christ intends his followers to lead, taking care of others with soft hands and compassion. So let us also be what God wants us to be. He intends us to take care of others just as he took care of us. So uh, uh, during this Christmas season, let us be like that to others and continue to be so in the coming new year. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.